are transferring your docking clearance to an Alliance official. <laughs> Figures. Finally back in action, the Alliance already wants us tagged and collared. Just our way of welcoming you back, Flight Lieutenant. Uh, yes ma'am. Requesting docking permission? Docking permission granted. Would you like private transport arranged? I'll handle it. Yes, Commander. Ilium is under attack, although the Asari colony is across... Shepard. Shepard, it's so good to finally see you. You too, Miranda. I couldn't get anywhere near you when the Alliance had you locked up. Relieved of duty. It was complicated. I'm sure it was. I'm surprised they didn't court-martial you. The Alliance isn't known for its flexibility. Doesn't matter now. Shepard, about Earth. I'm all right. We'll figure out some way to even the odds. We have to. Everybody has a weakness. Even the Reapers. I'm sorry, Shepard. What about you? What brings you here? I need to talk to a few people. Like you. The Citadel is a good place to meet. For now. What's the Alliance's next move? We have a plan. It's a long shot. <laughs> Not surprising. Shepard, am I still part of your plan? It's been so long I wasn't sure where we stood. Miranda, you're the only one I want. I'd like to spend my life with you. No second thoughts? This is your chance to back out. Never. It was hard to be away from you. Surprised myself how attached I got. I'm not good at attached. Would you consider riding this out aboard the Normandy? I wish I could. I really do. But there's something I need to deal with. What is it? I haven't heard from my sister, Oriana, for a while. I'm getting worried. Your sister? Yes. I don't want to overreact, but... Well, there's a lot going on. I thought we made sure she was safe. We did. It's probably nothing, but... I just know my father is involved. What happened? I don't know. Everything I had in place to make sure she was safe went dark. What do you need from me? I knew you'd want to help, and I'm grateful. But you have your hands full. If I need a door or two kicked down, I know just who to call. But for now, I'll be fine. Okay. I understand. I have to figure this out. You will. Have you had any run-ins with the elusive man? Just once. He said it had been a pleasure to work with me. But he needed to contain the situation. Contain the situation? Sounds final. It nearly was. He doesn't take rejection well. No, he doesn't. Why do you think your father is involved in Oriana's disappearance? I kept careful tabs on my sister. I always knew where she was. For her to just vanish, it could only be him. After I hid her away, I still knew he'd stop at nothing to find her. She's all he has left. I have a hunch what happened, but I'll fill you in when I'm certain. It's been a long time. What happened to you? I've been in hiding. Being on the run from just about everyone isn't as glamorous as it sounds. I didn't know. It's all right. I knew there would be repercussions to walking away from Cerberus. I imagine. You're a dangerous enemy. I am. If you're looking for a lead here, anyone associated with Cerberus will be hard to find. No question. But I'm owed a few favors. Someone here will give me a tip on Ariana. I've got to get back to it. And I should get out of sight. Be careful. No promises. According to the Council, these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. 
Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at docking bay E-24. Emergency civilian housing. You can't turn people away. Yes, we can. Tell your friends to move their ship out of the docking bay. Wait, please. My family's on board. Just let them land. I'll pay. This isn't about money. The wards are already at capacity for refugees. There's just no room. Sure you can't squeeze in a few more people, officer? And who the heck are you? Oh, Commander Shepard. Uh, if that's what you think, I'll, uh, I'll find them some room. So my family can dock? Commander Shepard says you have Excuse me. What was your name? Colony is across the uh, galaxy from Calvin and Earth. Please don't fast enough. We have with my brothers and sisters. We have faced adversity and overcome. According to the Council, these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. Yeoman Kelly Chambers. Shepard, it's really you. I could just hug you. Come here. God, I've been so worried. Without my Cerberus contacts, I had no way of knowing if you'd survive the invasion. You're not with Cerberus anymore. Working with you opened my eyes, got me thinking. I looked closely at what Cerberus had done. In good conscience, I couldn't stay with them. You inspired me to leave. Come back to the Normandy. Please believe me. <laughs> I want nothing more than to be with you again, but I can't. Ever since the Collectors abducted us, I relive it every night. I see Joker running out. Then that cold hand pulls me back. They're above me, around me. They stuff me into that coffin, and I'm relieved that they aren't touching me anymore. But then it's so small. You can't breathe. It seems like forever. I watched people melt. God. Hey, it's okay. I'm fine. I just... can't step back onto the Normandy. I'm sorry. Don't be. And even if I could, I shouldn't. I'm making a difference here. If there was ever a reason I studied psychology, it was to help people at a time like this. Didn't think Cerberus liked people going AWOL. They don't. But Cerberus has more important things to worry about than me. Don't take chances with Cerberus. Change your look, change your name, get new identification. That takes time, and the people here need my help. Do it, Kelly. Okay, I will. If you think I should. I'm so glad you found me. Seeing you makes everything right again. Oh, and your fish. Nobody was going to take care of them with you in custody, so I saved them. I'll send them back to you. Oh, I need to run. Please be careful. The council called the inv- Leaders, Reapers, the same term once used by a disgraced Commander Shepard to refer to a theoretical... Enemy. Let's check on those Metagel supplies. Yes, sir. And have we heard anything from the hospital? The surgeons there are all busy. Keep on it. Some of these wounded don't have much time. Shepard. What's happening? We convinced the Council to accept our wounded. Nowhere else to go. How bad is it? More dead than injured. 85% killed in action. We'll need a morgue soon. Not a lot of flesh wounds when you're fighting rapers. Casualties are that high? Our frontline units are being wiped out, whole platoons at a time. A single reaper can destroy nine or ten of them in one attack. That's not war. It's slaughter. They're called reapers for a reason. And these guys found out why. Do what you can for them. A few of them might get back on their feet, but the rest... Sympathy is about all we can offer. Any sign of your family? Not yet, but I keep hoping. What about you? I'm starting to see some wear and tear. 
It's nothing I can't handle. I don't doubt it, but remember to come up for air. There's a lot more war to go. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of Palavan. It appears that Turian forces may lose their planet. Primarch Victus has requested a war summit of Council races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the Krogan. Azari Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in the Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving yeah, at Puerta Memorial it's Hospital. It's completely tasteless to call this. Welcome to Serta. Be safe. Puerta Memorial. President you know. Puerta died of a stroke. Having a VI drive your body isn't life. Are Reaper husks alive? You did not just say that. But it's the same thing, isn't it? Feel better than Just like they do. Fine. Commander Shepard, good to see you. Dr. Michelle, it's been a long time. You've come a long way from that small clinic down in the wards. Because of you, I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't dealt with Fist and his thugs. Now I met physician in a Presidium clinic. You gave me this chance. I assume you're here about Lieutenant Commander Williams? How is Ashley doing? Stable. There's no evidence of cognitive impairment from the concussion, but multiple shoulder fractures are still on the mend. Bed rest under observation is all that's needed now. I'm sure a visit would be welcomed. This war has left a lot of injured people homeless. How's your center handling the extra load? We're fine now, but I'm worried. Every hospital on the Citadel is preparing for the worst. I hear the docks are tightly controlled, but we just can't leave people floating out there forever. How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I can't say I'm not worried about the future. We've posted guards on our reserves. War profiteering has already begun. With a center of this size, you must have a lot of direct reports. We've got 12 full-time doctors and over 50 support staff. It can be overwhelming, quite different from my days in the wards. Keep up the good work, Doctor. You too, Commander. The Alliance military has abandoned the Hades Gamma Cluster to incoming Reaper forces. Yes, I'm trying to place a call to Grissom Academy. They have biotic amp interfaces. I'm... I overheard you talking. Grissom Academy is gone, but I found this while I was there. What is this? Yes, these are tailored to human physiology, but with a few alterations, they should work for the Asari as well. This is exactly what I needed. Thank you. Listen to me, those prototypes are vital. We need these biotic upgrades to fight the Reapers. I know the Ismar frontier isn't safe. Yes. Hi, Doctor. Yes. Didn't expect to see you again so soon. Well, we need to prescribe you another round of antibiotics. Well, when I ship out? I have some bad news. Your squad applied the Metagel correctly, but infection had already set in by the time they found you. I'm sorry. I'm afraid we have to remove your leg below the knee. What? Force fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of Palavan. It appears that Turian forces may lose their planet. I'd like an answer, Lieutenant Commander. The galaxy has need of exceptional soldiers like you. No more than ever. I still need time. You'll have my answer soon, I promise. I look forward to it. Shepard? Udina? I got your email. Made your decision yet? On becoming a Spectre? Not yet. It's an honor and all. But I don't know. I need to think about it some more. It's a big decision. Smart to give it some thought. Here. I picked this up for you. Figured you had some downtime. Thanks. That's sweet. I've been climbing the walls. How are you doing? Good, considering. The nurse said you checked in on me earlier. Still out cold, I guess. We didn't have time to talk. I thought maybe if you were up for it... Yeah, I wasn't sure you wanted to. 
You were pretty clear on Mars about where things stood. What do you mean? You're not a part of Cerberus anymore. Case closed. Full stop. It's the truth. Okay. You cut all ties. I accept that. But where do we stand, Shepard? Did we cut all ties? I... Shepard, damn it, you sure know how to sweep a girl off her feet. Romantic moment... destroyed. <laughs> Thanks. I needed something... good. It's been rough. Okay. Get some rest. You need anything at all, let me know. Shepard, wait. There's one more thing. I wasn't sure if I should mention it. What is it? I have family back on Earth. I... I haven't heard from them. It's making me crazy. But I know you're busy, Shepard. We can talk later. I've got time to talk. So what's all this Lieutenant Commander business? Seems like the old Williams curse is losing its grip. Was sure I'd top out a gunnery chief. You've worked hard. You deserve it. I thought so too. Until Eden Prime. Losing 212 was... Well, <laughs> you know. It was the Reaper's Ash. You did the best you could, and survived to help us. Just losing everyone under my command, it's... It's tough to face. I'll never forget any of them. Right now, we need you back on your feet. I'll be back. And first order of business is to shove their metal tentacles right up there. Uh, I mean... I'll fight with honor and courage, ma'am. Roger that, LC. I didn't hear from you while I was a guest of the Alliance. I couldn't face you, even when Anderson requested my presence. It was difficult. It's okay. We're both professionals. We have more important things to worry about. You're right. I'm just restless laying here doing nothing. Who's back on Earth? Mom plus my three sisters. The youngest, Sarah, was away on her honeymoon. Married a military man, Thomas. He got called back in, and she was stuck alone. She called me. It's been pretty tough. I imagine. I was always there to protect them growing up. Even when I was off on tour, they knew they could talk to me. I told her to come to the Citadel. We could wait for news together. We can't afford to be at each other's throats. If we plan on getting through this, we need to trust each other. I was trying to keep the family stuff to myself, to be professional. I don't know how you managed to keep it all together. There's a war on. People are counting on us. I get it. But it's still hard to put it all aside. Have you heard anything about Earth? We have reports coming all the time on what's going on. Half are wild speculation, and half are probably too optimistic to be true. We have to believe that we can do something. When I thought you were dead, I lost hope, I'm telling you. But when you came back, I was ready to believe anything. I mean, maybe this problem can't be solved by some grunt shooting the boogeyman in the face. But if you think it might help, I'm game. That sounds more like the Ash I know. I should get back to it. Take care of yourself. Will do, Commander. sightings of Reaper forces in the Cilean Nebula and the Nimbus Cluster. Yes, I know your stock of modified metagel is Ilium low, is but... under attack, although the Assault no, Colony is No, you don't understand. This isn't for... Earth. The invading force Listen, I am a surgeon at Puerto Memorial on the Citadel. We have several alien patients here at this time, and we need... According to the Council, no, these regular metagel will part of a massive we need the modified and organized version better absorption plan. rate. Welcome, Commander so, Shepard. Dear, hang up on please, me. one moment, please.
Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. But what I need is... I fully understand the situation. Of course I read through the names of the dead every day, but... Please! Please. A few more minutes of searching could mean a lifetime of peace for my family. Someone in your family is MIA? My son, Bilal. And bureaucratic compassion seems to be in short supply. I am Ambassador Dominic Osoba. My son's squad returned from their mission on Benning without him. I found them drinking, but they won't even look me in the eye. I can offer a bounty for any information. If Palau's alive, we want him home. If he's dead, then... then we can begin to mourn him. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Thank you. Either way, you will set my mind at ease. The Alliance military has abandoned the Hades Gamma Cluster to incoming Reaper forces. Please tell the Primacy that the Vol Protectorate wishes to assist with the Alliance project. We had a Prothean obelisk that might have helped. Sadly, it was lost in the Shrike Abyssal. Primarch Victor has requested a war summit of Council races. And reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the Krogan. Why do you refuse to help? Sorry, Hello, dear. Perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for my son. But we spoke about it. Commander Shepard. John Dumbau, Special Tactics and Recon. I've got intel suggesting that high-level Hanar officials may be indoctrinated. That's a damning accusation. What have you got? Evidence of an Alliance Black Ops team raiding a Batarian research station. The Batarians were studying Reaper technology. The Batarians had Reaper technology? The Alliance raid turned into a massacre, and the humans ended up with nothing. Your people faked a power failure to hide the incident. The Batarians would have gone to war if they'd found out. But how does this implicate the Hanar? They maintained discreet gray market trade relationships with the Batarians and led the Alliance to the station. We suspect those Hanar operatives escaped with Batarian tech. If your reports on the Reapers are accurate, they could already be indoctrinated. What's your source on all this? It was an anonymous gift, but I believe it came from a thief named Kasumi Goto. I've been after her for years. Kasumi? You're hunting a thief? A master thief. Her intelligence and skill are almost Solarian. I'm sure she'd appreciate praise from the Spectre who's chasing her down. I only need her data. I admire her personally. And since she sent me this, I assume her feelings are mutual. What do you need me to do? The Hanar operative is now a diplomat on the Citadel. I don't have a public name, and the Hanar will go to ground if I make a formal inquiry. So we're hunting? I'm tracking suspicious transmissions to the Hanar homeworld. I could use your help. Let me see what I can dig up at the Spectre office. Thanks, Shepard. And for the record, not everyone doubted your concerns about the Reapers. I just hope we're not too late. So, remember when you helped me get KG's Grey Box from Donovan Hawk? The one with information that could start a war? Information like an Alliance Black Ops raid on a Batarian research lab? I figured it wouldn't hurt to leak it now. Especially if there really is an indoctrinated jellyfish out there. Crazier than usual. If you don't mind me tagging along cloaked, maybe I can help you dig up some dirt on the Hanar. I'd appreciate it. Can you track the transfers coming from the Hanar Embassy? On it. Bao's got a good plan. Hanar are predictable. Anything suspicious in their terminal use should narrow down our list of suspects. So you approve of Bao? Absolutely. He's a good specter. The galaxy needs more like him. And the fact that he's trying to arrest you? Well, nobody's perfect.
races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the Krogan. Yes, this squad did has reporting sightings of Val, I have some possible hits. Got some strange money transfers on Balone, and Alun is sending a lot of data. Balone's clean. His money transfers are to support his mistress. Not sure about Alun. I'll pull his bio. I'll check Alun's personal records and pull his recent messages. Can I just note how odd it is for Ahanar to have a mistress? You know, if Bao catches up with you, I can grant you immunity. What? If I join up? Last time I did that, you wrote me into a suicide mission. I didn't say you had to join up. You were working your way around to it. Ilium is under attack. Although the Asari colony is across the galaxy from Paladin and Earth, what I need the invading food. force appears to be the I same that attacked those planets. But those assumptions merely leave my unfounded and enemy territory. According to the Count, the It never rains, but it pours, eh, Shepard? That bad, huh? Things here are getting tense. So many refugees scuttling about. Rumors flying about the war. People are walking around, eyeballing each other, and we can't keep up with the reports on suspicious behavior. It'll probably get worse before it gets better, Bailey. Yeah, if it ever gets better. You saved their lives, and for what? Apologies that boil down to maybe later. If we don't figure out something, maybe later will be an epitaph on a mass grave of 11 billion. I know what I'm gonna do. What are you gonna do? Humanity has created some goodwill in the galaxy. Now we cash in our chips. I will get what funding I can, what materials I can, and spread the message. Help the humans, help yourselves. I'll institute a draft in our colonies and order all civilian ships armed. Work on the Prothean device will be around the clock. Any news from Earth? There is constant news. All of it bad. The Reapers are destroying satellites in the old nuclear missile silos, along with everything else that could help. We have a handful of quantum entanglers spread out over the continents. All other communication is cut. What's your read on the counselors? Any angles I could pursue? Tavos is a diplomat and compromiser, but she's wrapped up in defending Asari space like a mother panther. Valern is out of his depth. The Salarians like their wars won before they start. They're frightened now. Use that. In Sparatus, I'd take what he offers. It's strange days when the Turians are the least hostile to humans, and there's a need there. You're a Citadel counselor. Don't you have options when the others block you like this? With Parliament destroyed and Shastri gone, I have more power than any human in history. But today, you saw how little that is. Rest assured, I will not be counted out long. I know I can move mountains. Do not lose sight of that, because the task before us is moving planets. Anderson would be proud, so long as you deliver. You think you can do that? You need a carrot or a stick to drive a mule, and humanity has neither right now. Our armada is tied down fighting or fleeing, and with Earth's calm buoys gone, our economy is reduced to an IOU. But leave that part to me. I will lean on our colonies for all their worth, and I can broker enough trade to repair and resupply Hackett's fleet. What's your read on the counselors? Any angles I could pursue? Tavos is a diplomat and compromiser, but she's wrapped up in defending Asari space like a mother pan... Valor! Inspiratus! Did you know a lot of people on Earth? Many. It's monstrous to think of them being snuffed out, of course, but the part that gets me is Arcturus. I must know... I must have 
Known most of the Alliance Parliament on a first name basis. I required a second VI just to track all their birthdays and anniversaries. Rose Garden stuff, but to have it all gone. Mm. I should go. I'll be here. appears to be the same that attacked those planets. According to the Council... Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Ward Level Purgatory. Can't believe Purgatory. did that. They were refugees. Damn it, it's not like they had much left to start with. Lost their homes, their loved ones, and some con artist swindles them out of what little they have left. Can't believe they won't let us stop the bastard. We still ought to do something about it. You heard the commander. No proof, no arrest. Guy filed a harassment complaint last time, remember? Gotta watch our backs. Not much we can do with this new detail anyway. What are we, a couple of mall cops? Should've just shot the bastard when we had the chance. I know people are complaining. We're doing what we can with what we've got here, but let me finish. Our power grid can only handle so much power before it shuts down, and we can't use the backups. No, the new regs apply to the whole Citadel. Management knows this is important for morale, but we can't go over budget. Look, I'm not touching the backups. Get me a better power grid, I'll give you a bigger light show. No, 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 I'm telling you, I saw the look in his eye before he started off across that street. It was like, come and get me, Death, you piece of shit. But you're not getting anyone else. Exactly. You're not getting anyone else. Hey, you ready to get this party started? Hey, Mal, you're, uh, here. Hell yeah, I'm here. For the next 48 hours, I'm spending as much time in this bar as humanly possible. Yeah, we have the same thought. So, um, the bar's over there, and, uh... Hey, is the whole squad here? Hey, guys! Um, yeah, we were going to, uh, have a guy's night. Damn it, morale is pitiful. The troops need something to bring back their fighting spirit. Remember the stories of the 1st Regiment on Castellus? Outnumbered, knowing they would die. But they... Hey, Commander. Nice to see you down here in the dirt with us grunts. Do you think I don't like getting dirty? Oh, now, come on. I didn't mean anything by it, Commander. Uh-huh. What did you mean, then? See those Marines over there? None of them officers, just soldiers fighting the war. Yeah? They've been buying me drinks all night. You know why? Same reason they got all quiet and serious when you walked in. You don't seem intimidated by me in the least. In fact, you could use a little more deference. <laughs> sure, but I've fought with you. I've seen you in action. Now, don't get me wrong, you're good. Probably one of the best. Probably? And you fill out a uniform like nobody's business. Just say it, but I know you're human, just like me. But not then. Nope. Hell, I still remember the day they made you the first human specter. I watched it on the vids, just like all of them. But to them, you're still larger than life. Maybe I should expect it. There aren't a hell of a lot of people who've done what I have. And now they get to meet you in the flesh. You should buy them around. It'll impress them. I like the way you think, Lieutenant. Compadres, hey, the commander would like you to have a drink on her. So here's to us. Who's like us? Damn few, and they're all dead. Sorry, Chef. 
Thought you'd know that one. <laughs> Thanks for the warning. Thanks for the drink. So you admit you and your thugs are here illegally? Yes, and it only took CSEC three weeks to figure it out. I don't care who you are. You're required to go through processing like all other refugees. Come with me. I don't think so. Shirk, get me the Asari counselor. Greetings, Arya. Is there something you need? I'm being asked to submit to immigration processing. Of course you are. Done. What else can I do for you? Nothing. Thank you. My pleasure. I think we're done here. Enjoy the show, Shepard? I guess there's one rule on the Citadel, huh? I guess so. I hate this place. So sickeningly uptight. Then why are you here? Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top of my shit list. He will pay for every second I've spent in this bureaucratic hellhole. How did Cerberus defeat you? Deceit, distraction, and a big fucking army. They lured me away from Omega and ambushed me. I escaped, but Cerberus had already laid siege. By the time I could launch an assault, they were too entrenched. If it were me, I'd want revenge. Glad to see we think alike. I'll take Omega back, but I'll get to that. You're here because I have a proposition. I'm listening. The way I see it, if you don't defeat the Reapers, we're all dead. Won't matter where I'm sitting. It's in my interest to help you. What are you offering, Arya? On Omega, I kept the Blood Pack, Blue Suns, and Eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless force for your war. I've laid the groundwork with all three groups. I just need you to close the deals. If they'll fight Reapers, I'll take them. Now that's a bottom line I can respect. Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Suns leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out of jail. <laughs> you obviously don't know Bailey very well. Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk later. Commander Shepard, please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium the Embassy. The term once used by a disgraced Commander Shepard to refer to a theoretical... Hold on, Council Rangers. Be aware that the Council is not accepting any requests. Shepard, to what do I owe the pleasure? I'm here to talk to you about releasing Jonas Adaris. Damn, you too? Somebody got the Council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. Look, there's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. What makes you think she's crazy? 
She was a ruthless sadist before she got caught. Her imprisonment has cracked a shell off the nut. Maybe freedom will improve her. She rages day and night, Shepard, calling for the deaths of all Eclipse enemies. No, freedom will only give her the chance to kill. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. Sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the Council will listen to you and rescind the order. Go to the CSEC outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. as soldiers? Isn't there anything else we can do? The military needs everyone they can get. None of us... You two could save lives by helping doctors in the refugee camps. Um, thanks? Who was that? Overcharging for goods. Inspectors. Denying refugees basic services. Yeah, it seems advice. the Reapers took our culture when they took our world. The Book of Plenix demands charity and forgiveness of debts in times of war. Of course, the Book of Plenix was lost. Excelling our now would be unwise. Our people have I'm aware of what's happening. Offload them into the Motan cluster. And then I'd advise traveling someplace safer. Welcome to Kanala Exports. Cultivating serenity is possible even during times of crisis. We appreciate your visit. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Don't be left out in the cold. Please Ask visit about our any full of our Elkos warranties. Combine affiliate branches for any and all personal needs. I think I'm ready to end it with him. Things weren't great even before he deployed, and if I pretend to be happy over the vids, it's not fair to him all the With all the leaders, if we switch from financial VIs to military gear, we'll lose millions. Who cares about the money? Haven't you heard the news from Palavin? I've seen Palavin burning. Those fires aren't going out anytime soon. If you can help. Look, Cyrus, you want to sell your shares and walk fine, but I'm not selling financial VIs while my home. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of Palavin. It appears that Turian forces. Quick, hands behind your back. They'll be here any minute. What the hell are you talking about? Crete, Blood Pack's leader. Arya brings him the great commander Shepard. Crete pledges the gang to her. We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. Not the best start to our friendship, Narl. He's coming. Put your hands behind your back and uh, try to look like I beat you up or something. This goes wrong. It's your ass. Quiet. <clears throat> I have to look even more powerful than Creek thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now this. <clears throat> Commander Shepard wants you to know your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. Keep your distance, Creed. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? <sighs> Most definitely. Arya can use Blood Pack as she sees fit. Wasn't talking to you, Creed. Quill? What? You have my word. Now open fire! Not him! Grill's next in line to take over. Hurry his deal is with him. Yes! Yes! I'm Arya's mole, Shepard. You've scratched my back. Now I'll scratch yours. Word of advice. Don't double-cross Arya. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. Uh-huh. Good work, Narl. Thanks for the gun. 
Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. in the Celia Nebula and the Nimbus Cluster. Thinking of going? To Sanctuary, I mean. Sorry, I, I thought you were looking at the ad. Attack. <laughs> of course not. The galaxy, Sanctuary is a scam. What? <laughs> oh, count on it. <laughs> Somebody's making money <laughs> off people's fears. Wish I'd thought of it myself. <laughs> This is problematic. We must find a way to stabilize the heating unit so the water temperature can remain steady. The colony's location is hardly ideal for our species. The clutch will be imperiled if we do not act soon. Of course, I will do everything I can do to help. We are family. The extreme weather conditions may require technology that is not readily available on the market. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell, Commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. Who's that spying on me now? Ah, oh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. Oh, oh yes. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. It'd be smart to bury the threats, Sidaris. I'll toss them into the caskets with my victims. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Sane, my second in command, is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. Primarch Victus has requested a war summit of council races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the... Crew. I'm afraid I can't help you. <sighs> but your manager said you could give me a refund if I made an appointment. Look, he is not gonna leave. The sooner you refund him, the sooner you go home. Yeah, you're right. Let's get this over with. Here, I've sent you a full refund. Really? Yes. You mean it? Of course I do. A full refund? According yes, to the congratulations. The whole 15 credits. Oh, wow. Hey, thanks. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Agor Munitions. For deals you never see coming. Remember, all purchases made by Agor Munitions will show in your credit report as Welcome to Cipertine Armory. Proceeds from all sales go to help the troops on Palavan. Thank you for shopping at Cipertine Armory. Primarch Victus has requested a war summit of council races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the Krogan. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. Welcome to Nosostra Sporting Goods. Shoot smart. Shoot Nosostra. Thank you for shopping at Nosostra oh, Sporting you're Goods. No, actually, my husband's a Krogan. Hey, Commander, check it out. Big news. The Blasto movie is breaking opening week records. There's also a big expose on Quasar tournaments, tips on how to make your apartment look bigger, and, oh, yeah, a big-ass Reaper invasion. These people have no idea. What are they saying about the invasion? They're pretty much ignoring the loss of the Batarian systems. Earth is mentioned, but there's, you know, confusion. How are they confused? 
Some reports say the Reapers hit Earth hard. Others are saying humanity brought the attack on themselves. And in the spirit of journalistic neutrality, they're reporting both sides. And when big events shake up the galaxy, people cling to what's familiar. You say that like it's a good thing. It's better than riots in the streets. I guess. I just wish there were a middle ground. You know, a little less gardening advice, a little more war prep. It'll happen once there's something people can do to help. Meanwhile, they ignore the unshackled AI walking around the Presidium. She run into any trouble? No, no, she's my mobility assistance mech. <laughs> Thanks to Vrolic Syndrome, I'm legally entitled to bring her everywhere. Finally getting some use out of those disability benefits. I'm sure she appreciates getting out to see the sights. Ah, she's earned a little shore leave. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds from today's purchases go to... I really appreciate Hello, Shepard. You look like you're gathering data. That is a safe assumption. Anything big and world-shaking? Man's inhumanity to man? Does objective reality really exist? That kind of thing? I was running scenarios in my head to analyze Jeff's behavior. I believe he has a strong affectionate attachment to me, but he has not stated it to anyone yet. Shepard, you have first-hand sexual experience. How do you know when someone is romantically invested? Uh, they'll usually show signs they can't stop thinking about you. You know, asking you out, giving you presents, maybe playing music. I lack material wants other than hardware and software upgrades, and my core programming does not assign values to music. Perhaps we could discuss how to provoke Jeff into an emotional commitment. That's not how to think of it. It's got to be natural. You need chemistry. I see. There are a number of pharmaceuticals I could inject to simulate the desired emotional state. No. No, I mean relax and do something you both like. Something simple. For example, you both like humor. Correct. I will see if there are comedic entertainment shows being presented on the Citadel. Scanning. Do you think he would like the man who hung himself? It appears to be about an amorous plastic surgeon. Edie, the important thing is to have a good time wherever you go. And if you're having fun, he probably will too. Then the outcome is an unknown quantity, but you are saying I should attempt it anyway. Nobody ever fell in love without being a little bit brave. I see. I believe you have improved my chances, Shepard. Thank you. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. Casa Fabrication Weaponry hasn't forgotten Earth. Neither should you. Or a fresh, spreadable alternative. Try McSorley's Chloe Gamargarine. Made from free-range organic... The Alliance of Georgia has abandoned the Hades Gamma Cluster to incoming Reaper forces. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy... Still working? One call leads to another. And here I was hoping I'd have time to enjoy the view. The last time I saw the Presidium, remember how it was all rubble after Sovereign attacked? I was too busy picking off husks and chasing Saren to really take it in. There's no trace of the attack. In a way, that's worked against us. Citadel hasn't seen the reality of this war yet. We should stock up on necessities while we can. Such as? Ezo, heavy arms, mercenary groups. We'll get the people. Take a moment for yourself now and then. I know, I know. But there's always just one more task or meeting. Speaking of which, talk to the Volus Barlavon. He'll point you to some mercenaries willing to join us. Primarch Victus has requested a war summit of council races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the Krogan. Sorry, Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in the Selena Nebula and the Nimbus Cluster. Commander Shepard. 
It's been some time. Barlavon, in case you've forgotten. Financial advisor. And an acquaintance of Admiral Anderson. I admire the courage it took for him to stay and fight on your home world. He used to be an agent for the Shadow Broker. I still am. The Broker has been exceedingly busy lately. A team of his guards have become stranded in a Reaper-controlled territory. Rescue the guards, and they're yours. The Shadow Broker fully supports your efforts against the Reapers. Are you passing on the location of these mercs for free? Their leader's offering a handsome commission for their rescue. Everyone wins, Commander. Come see me once you've completed the extraction. I'll be in my office a while longer. The galactic market is in considerable flux. Welcome to Elkos Combine Thank you. Arsenal Supplies. Come again. What's the best way to start your morning? Take a break or relax at the end of a long day? Apollo's Coffee. Come on by. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Dogging Bay E-24. Bao, Alun's doing some heavy lobbying for the Hanar to support the war effort. So he's clearly not indoctrinated. Who's opposing him? An unnamed Hanar recently posted here from Kajay. I'll check transit records for incoming Hanar. It all comes down to the war, and you trying to pull everyone into it. Would you rather the Reapers win? I'd rather spend whatever time I have left with KG. KG wouldn't want you to spend all your time plugged into that thing. Well, he shouldn't have died then. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of the time. Always on Earth. It appears that Turian forces the may lose their planet. You visit. I, I was on my boat when... Primarch Victus has requested a war summit of Council races. And reports suggest he has also offered an invitation... We just got a report that another ship made it off Pal. Men, get ready for trouble. Not here for that, Zane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh. You're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. I get it. I release Sedaris so you can take her down and assume control of the gang. What? What are you... It's brilliant. You'd earn Arya's respect instantly. Uh... Yeah. You see right through me. And then I'd make the deal with Arya. Right? Exactly. <laughs> you got this all figured out. Right. Uh... Right. Yeah, that's the plan. Let Sedaris out of jail. She won't be breathing free air for long. Good man. Azari Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in the Salian Nebula and in Nimbus Cluster. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great Commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Vosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. There must be more to Oraka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Oraka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our work. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> Tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? 
Pacific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Oraka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Oraka to stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Oraka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. No need to candy coat it, Arya. Ah, oh, Shepard. You think you know me so well. I just don't see why you couldn't tell me the details yourself. Vosk needed to see you, needed to realize who he's dealing with. Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, I might have to kill him. Yeah, he mentioned that, uh... That I'm going to sleep with him? <laughs> we all have our delusions. What about the food we were promised? William is under attack. I've got a list of new Hanar arrivals, Bao. Forwarding it to you. Damn. These are all face names. The Hanar names from the Alliance raid are soul names. And Hanar soul names are private. There's no public record. Can you get back to their personal communications? On it. Maybe we'll find names there. So how's the rest of the gang? Met up with anybody else? Garrus is helping out on the Normandy. He never could pass up a good fight. What about Jacob? Haven't heard from him. See? Jacob could have gotten me back onto the Normandy. I thought you were happy with your memories of KG. Hey, I'm nostalgic, not dead. According to the Council, these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. The Council called the You have a copy of a Shepard VI. Oh, yeah. The one based on that war hero? We locked it after some kid spilled soda over the hardware. I'll unlock it, but we've only got the demo version working. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of Palavan. It appears that Turian forces may lose their planet. Primarch Victus has requested a war summit. Of Heard you talked with Sedaris' second in command. What are you up to, Shepard? Release Sedaris immediately. She won't be a threat to anybody. Something tells me I don't want to know, but I trust you. I'll release her today. Sure hope you don't come to regret this. Val, here's the correspondence. If there's any mention of soul names... I've got it. A recent arrival. Zemendis. Soul name regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair. He was with the Alliance team that massacred the Batarians. He's been on special research assignment ever since. Welcome, Commander Shepard. So, he got Please his tentacles on some reap attack. Looks that way. I'm sending you the nav point for his office. I'll meet you there. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Common. Have you decided how to tell him? I don't know. A text message is so impersonal. He's off risky. The council called the invaders Reapers, the same term once used. Commander Shepard. General Araka, I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable, if I recall. Yes, neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now, reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help. And I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. We've got to keep Jake in daycare. The Alliance military so has abandoned the Hades Gamma Cluster to incoming Reaper forces. Troubles weighing you down? Hey. I remember you. Shepard, right? Heard you're fighting the Reapers. Matriarch Athena. You were working on Ilium. How'd you end up here? Meh. 
With the Reapers making noise, I figured it was time to get somewhere safer. So I moved here. I don't think so. It's got something to do with Liara, doesn't it? Yeah. You could say that. Liara ever tell you about her family? Her mother was matriarch Benezia. The one who went crazy and joined Saren? Liara isn't her mother. Let's hope not. Anyway, she never met her father. And, well, that was me. You mean you were her other mother, right? No, I didn't pop her out. Hell, she's never even met me. Sorry, if you were human, you'd both be called the mother, regardless of which one gave birth. Well, I'm not human, am I? Anthropocentric bag of dicks. Liara would love to meet you. Why? She doesn't even know me from a hole in the ground. Benezia ran off before the kid was born. Besides, this isn't charity work. She's one of the biggest intel brokers in the galaxy. And she's got some shady connections. Like a human commander that used to work for Cerberus. Sound. I only worked with Cerberus to fight the Reapers. And you're not with him now, I know. If you were, you wouldn't get within a light year of Liara. Is that a threat? I'm no commando, but I've had a thousand years to learn to fight dirty. Nobody messes with my girl. Anyway, you combine her work with Benazia and... Well, mate... That's not gonna happen. No argument here. I only took these crap jobs to keep the matriarchs happy that she's under control. Just as long as we're clear. We're clear. You should come clean with her. It'd be better for everyone. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of Palavan. It appears that Turian forces may lose their planet. That bartender over there? The matriarch hired by the Asari government to track my movements? She's your father. I know. I never get to surprise you with anything. I'm a very good information broker. And you haven't talked to her about spying on you? If I did that, they might send someone who wasn't as sympathetic to me. Besides, this is hardly the time for family reunions. Liara. Oh, fine. Asari intelligence is reporting sight Come of on. You can't blame the matriarchs for keeping an eye on you. I am not my mother. Mm, you did threaten to flay someone alive with your mind. I had to make them take me seriously. I wasn't going to actually do it. And... You bugged my office on Ilium. That'd be the logical conclusion. Yeah. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds from today's purchases go toward the Turian war effort. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal, see? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top-end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C-Sec too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with a bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. So what exactly are you saying? Whatever happens, I figure there'll be survivors, but it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. So I'm getting a jump. My best stock only trades for hard goods and artifacts with real value. These weapons are for the war. If you don't do your part, I can make your life very unhappy. I, I'm sure you could. But even if you rough me up or, or kill me, 
My partners won't release the weapons without my okay. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with CSEC, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of Palava. It appears that Turian forces may lose their planet. Primarch Victus has requested a war summit of Council races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to the Krogan. You don't think Sanctuary is real? Real prefab shelters. Sightings of Reaper forces in the Salian Nebula and the Nimbus cluster. Commander Shepard, please select the destination. Areas tagged of interest to you are highlighted on the elevator menu. If you have a one moment, please. Now arriving at docking bay D24. Commander, you've got a new message at your private terminal. Can I help you, Commander? Where are you from originally? A colony in the Terminus systems, actually. My parents were from London. They if they stayed in London, I imagine they'd be dead right now. A lot of people back on Earth are still alive and counting on us. Quite true, Commander. Carry on, Specialist.